absolutely beautiful sunny 75 october thanksgiving day down here what's up guys how's it going mark freedom 408 we got the fleet that's right i haven't jumped anything in a while we tried to do the dodge but you know we had some trouble so i'm now mad and i'm taking a bit of a break we got Cornet, he's back from the west the west oh that's my cd there yeah it's a mixtape yeah for you <laughs> that thing still have a cd player no I don't think they make CD players I don't think so either. So before we do some donuts, I think we should probably take that dirt bike out the back. Just in case. I think you should leave it in. I don't know, man. I don't want that dirt bike falling over. It's not gonna fall over. Just gotta believe. Look, you got freaking 3,500 pound straps on it. You know where that thing's going? Nowhere. <laughs> Nowhere. Yeah, you're fine. It's just, and if it does, it's just a Honda. <laughs> it's just a Honda. Yeah, it's a matching Honda to your truck. Yeah. Red on red, not too bad, right? Red on red. All right, let's do that. Do some donuts. Do some donuts. Love the donuts. And, and then I'm gonna. Uh, we got a whole bunch planned today. We're just gonna make a really long video. Cause I know you guys enjoy really long videos. So, what are we gonna do? Flamethrower, smoke, Ford recall, target practice with the potato gun. We made a spear. Where are the odds this dirt bike's gonna fall over? I can say low, but you never know. Oh, he's good. Car straps holding that thing in just moistly. That's how we turn up the track now. Self dodge. Look at those donuts. You got it. Sweetness. Approved. See, I told you. I told you it wouldn't fall over. You got car I see that roll back and forth in the box. <laughs> you got that car straps on that thing. Good. I think we're good. She's fine. All right, you want to park this thing? Just actually yeah. park it right here. So what do we got today? We got gasoline, diesel, potato gun, two tables, some tools under there, and a gray box. And what do we got in the back seat? My truck is always full of crap. Got some cardboard, some paper to light on fire. Went to the dollar store because we're going to do the shooting range later. Got some waivers. Got some new Carhartt shirts. Thank you to Carhartt. And I got my Halloween costume. So we're going to start with... I think we should start with the diesel in the Mitsubishi. I know we just did that video, but I want to do it again. I want to see how it works. Because it was really funny. And I didn't get to drive last time. Mark is good, so... You unloading that thing already? Hell yeah. I'm excited to ride. <laughs> she, uh, we got a surprise storm last night. It wasn't supposed to rain. and then We were sleeping and all of a sudden frickin' flew out of bed. The window was open and it was the loudest bang. Big old tea storm. So, all right, let's get this thing set up and make her smoke. Number two, he's ready. Ready to rip. No co shaving cream, the key. What could go wrong? Look at that thing. Makes me laugh every time I walk by it. We should do another video on it soon. Hey, pop this. There we go. Maybe this will make this freaking smell better. I wonder how wet the seats are. Yeah, not too bad. Oh, well, that's wet. There we go. Like one of those videos you see on the dark side of the internet. <laughs> Give her a shake. Got some wheel, some wheel polish on this thing. That's how you shine these things up. Dollar store shaving cream, super max. Oh, there's to be writing on here. Gibbs Wilson. Do -do -do. 
Just shining up my wheels. There you go. What, did you change your clothes? Yeah. I never know what you're up to. <laughs> what are you doing? That's not a tire foam, Mark. Yeah, it is. Look at that. It's, it's, it's super max. It's shaving cream, sir. Looks the same. All right. It's even back seat foam. I put some in the back there. Oh, right on. Right on. All right. Oh, it looks like somebody had an accident back there. <laughs> That's what I said. Weird things happen in the Ford Explorer. Oh, why is this soaked? Oh, the roof. Well, I guess I have to find something to sit on. Unless I want a moist butt. Will she start? No. All right, find something to sit on. Uh, found the perfect seat cover. Nice four weight sweater. We don't need that where we're going. There you go, try it butt. All right, tire foam applied. No co, boosting the battery. We got some diesel, AKA coolant. Dye diesel at that the windshield washer fluid. As you can see, we rerouted the windshield washer line into the suction tube. So, have you seen this before? No. Yeah. It's pretty neat. Credit goes to Marcus Rampel, Mark Media, if you want to check him out on YouTube. He, uh, he was the master of doing this one, so. And it's crazy how fast you'll go through a tank of diesel doing it. <laughs> Quite fast. I guess I should start it. You gotta get her nice and hot first. See if she'll start. Ugh, forget if this thing has power steering. I don't think it does. No. <laughs> Up. Now she doesn't want to start at all. This could take a while. I'm sure there's still some diesel in it from the. Okay. Yeah, that's the diesel way. Yeah. Rock and roll, boys. I know. It's a Mitsubishi. I smell gas. Oh, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> it's got a quarter tank. Still smoking. Maybe we should have started before we put the diesel on it. Think so? Yeah. yeah. I think that diesel's from the last time, so. Shouldn't really matter. I'm still confused how the seat got all wet. None of the windows were open. I know, that doesn't help me. Come on, boy! We believe! Maybe some tire foam would help. So, I think tire foam. Put it in the fan. Put it in the the fan. fan. Yeah, blow some in the fan. Okay, All right. Start. Now your fan blades are white, so that might help. Extra know. lubrication. Freaking airplane. Scat. Come on, we had you go in there for a sec. I'm gonna have to let her sit for a minute. All right, we're gonna let this thing sit for a moment and uh, let her think about what she's done and we're gonna get the convertible going. I think we'll rip that around. We'll do some target practice with it. Get the, uh, get the old spear gun out and uh, yeah, see if we can put some spears through it. I think we killed the NOCO there, but luckily I got booster cables in my truck, so. She feels a little warm, not gonna lie. Well, she's meant to start, not hold it wide open. I like your hood holder there. Yeah, right. Works well. Oh yeah, as long as you don't move, the hood doesn't move. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I guess I'll find the key for this thing, eh? Give her a whirl. All right, the NOCO, we killed it with this thing, so. I can't remember. I can't remember if this one stays on or not. No, it doesn't. Hmm. Can we try that other one again for a second? This girl, I got faith in her, you know. I got lots of faith in these little girls. Well, I guess we can boost it off the truck now. Like, once this thing's going, it's good. It just takes a bit because someone decided to dump 
five liters of diesel through it and another five more. All right, I will move my truck over and we'll, let's just try and boost her till she boosts. All right. Good old Ford, the old Fajord. Remember, red on black, black on red. This is your first time? Oh, these things, these Ford trucks, I swear they make them so difficult to put booster tape on. Why don't you just put it on the end? Here right on the boat? Yeah, right there, sure. Sure. Not my truck. <laughs> it's not mine either. So <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's all you. Who cares? They make new ones every day. Watch, it'll start perfectly for you, probably. You might want to get in there and hold her. Uh, they're on the front seat. <laughs> From the last time I was in there, two minutes ago. Hey, did you really have to go when you went in this car? Is it, is it pretty wet? Well, I put the sweater down for it. Oh, it's back in this truck. There we go. Remember, once she starts going wide open. Well, at least we know the engine's all lubed up with... Diesel, that diesel. I love the fan blades. Come on, girl. Is there a setup? Just smoking. This one's smoking yet? Getting warm? Not really. Yeah. I had high hopes for this one. I don't see smoke coming out. Yeah, a little bit. This full of diesel. She was going for a little bit there. See, it like kind of sputters. Come on, Mitts. All right, I have another idea. Here's what we're gonna do. What's the idea? We're gonna get this dot started. We're gonna put it over there. We're gonna leave the booster cables on here, let it think about what it's done. And then while, while this is kind of charging, we'll get the spear gun out and we'll shoot Warren Mitchell one. Follow Warren Mitchell, by the way, guys. He's the one that brought this old beast over that ran away from me 20 times. Does that work? You yeah. can just leave the key in there because we'll we'll be so back. You want the Dodge over there, Smurfs? Yeah, we'll put the we'll put the Dodge over by I don't know, okay. somewhere. You know, outside of that sheet of plywood. Somewhere over there, or over there, I guess. I guess we just back it up to there. Maybe let's do that. Back up to over there. Yeah, just to that car jump. The stupid Dodge. Not a fan of it. Even though it has freaking Zamboni tires, even though it's, all its tires are flat and the airbags went off and it's full of crap and it's wet, <laughs> there's probably something living in it and it's dead. <laughs> oh, I just can't win with this thing. All right, let's boost this thing, move it back and do some target practice with it. Hick and map. This thing is hilarious. Zamboni tires, studded Zamboni tires. I think I'm definitely gonna keep these for the Maverick. Well, it's got two studded tires. These front ones aren't, but. Flexing, so we got power in action. This one's studded. Look at that, studded tires. All right. Ah. All right, what does it say on this side? Yee Yee Mitch Compound, Mitchell Compound. Dodges hate dodges, and you sound nice. <laughs> hey, hate dodges, dodges hate me. <laughs> Take them booster cables off, or? Yeah, sure, sure. Sure? You want that hood closed? It's all friction, right? There you go. Oh, oh, she's spinning.
Oh, he just must have dropped her down a gear. She sure flings mud like a dodge, though. See that? Bullet holes. Looks like this thing's been like downtown Detroit. It was born and raised there. <laughs> Round four or three or seven. I don't know. Hope you guys enjoyed the dodge. You want to see the spear made? Spear we made. I have a super heavy one, but it's almost too heavy. I don't know if you guys saw it in one of the last videos. Not the last videos, but like 10, 15 videos ago. It's probably 50 pounds. And, uh, I tried shooting it straight and it just kind of drops, but I think if you shoot it straight up, it'll go well. But this one is probably, probably five, eight pounds. So we just cut the end off, put a little barb on it to really do some damage, smashed her down. And then we took a hot air balloon rope and zip tied it to the end. Cause you always need a tail. Why do you put a tail on, Corey? You can ask me. So it flies straight. I was not in the medieval times, so I wasn't born right Because if you just put a bar through the air, it might fly straight, but there's odds are it won't. So if you put a little drag on the back, a little friction. You like dragons? I do. Not even going to tell you why. <laughs> <laughs> it has been so windy for like a week since like before Thanksgiving weekend in Canada. When is it going to stop being windy? She wants it. Don't you put too much uh, coolant in her. Not enough, not enough uh, shaving cream. Well, let's let it sit a, lot, a little longer. We'll do. Uh, Oh, Scott's here. It's target practice time. A little oh, early. Oh, oh, look at that. 3.49, shooting with Scott, 4 p.m. Rot row. Spaghetti yo. As he crashes right into the side of my truck. Look at this. <laughs> Scott, let's see some donuts. It's mandatory. I'm not sure if they just got them in them. The Honda? All Hondas have it in them. Even better, you can drift. <laughs> so before we start shooting, we're gonna we're gonna shoot this thing with a spear. Spear a couple times. Do you want to do? You want to be the first one? Yeah. All right. Show you what we're working with. Take your cable nah, leave them on. We'll get her going. I, I still believe that it'll get going. Just we, we just made this. <laughs> we even put a little barb on the end to really do some damage. It's actually a smiley face. And we zip tied a balloon rope to it. What's this one? Drag, so it flies straight. <laughs> or whips a bird on the way by. <laughs> All right, let's pump this thing up to 100 PSI and fire it at the dodge. If it goes up to 100. That's all you need. Low, Look how sweet this air pump is. 
Princess Auto Special, boys. Hey, if you ever have a flat tire, I got you a pump. $5.99? I think it was 30 bucks. So it's got a light on it. <laughs> I think it's got an FM radio, maybe XM. Everything. All right, Corny, try to start this thing again. We got a few more minutes. Loving those boots, by the way. Looking prime. So this is our diesel mobile. We rigged up diesel in the washer fluid, then put it into the suction tube. And she blows lots of smoke, but. What's with the tire? Oh, I put tire foam on it, AKA shaving cream. <laughs> Things struggling over there, eh? Why? About the pump or this? Yeah. I think this it's still has diesel in it from last time. It's not thick yeah. You want to go check that pump? See where we're at? Come on, Mitsubishi, I got high hopes for you. <laughs> All right, scrap it. She's fine. How are we doing here? <sighs> ah, almost at 90. We're in the red. This thing is warm, holy. Oh, hey. Actually, once we shoot the spear, you should come ripping through that puddle. Yeah. The Dutch. Huh? Just let go of the steering wheel when you go through it, though. Oh, it doesn't have power steering, and you don't want to break your thumbs. We'll move the vehicles as well. Well, I'll move my truck. Yeah. yeah. Unless you want to take the convertible over there. Might get muddy. I got a no-co, might be charged. Oh, you got a charge in now. Yeah. All right, good enough. I don't know if that's gonna, you're gonna have to pack her in. Get your noodle in there. Yeah, oh, oh gotta hold it. Jesus. Actually, hold, use the front first. Use the tip, yeah. Use the tip. Damn the tip in there. The tip's always better. Yeah. I the t-shirt coming up. Oh, what the hell? See? It's almost like you put that in there. Yeah. <laughs> I, I spit on it. There you go. Those zip ties really help a fly straight as well. Just don't press it right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there you go. We need uh, something else. You got any pointy stuff in there? Don't stand in front of us. It might go through your head. Just, yeah, it's out of track. That's okay. Yeah, yeah. No, no, it'll go over it. What's this no, she's insured. Don't hit that. <laughs> when in doubt. Should we put it this way? Yeah. Yeah, because the fly is Well, obviously. Be no, 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 no. Just push right on the end. We just gotta get the get her. Oh, you're talking in front of the. Spear. Yeah, I don't want to shoot my umbrella. I like that umbrella. Just push the spear all the way down. Oh. Yes, he's back. I thought we were shooting the umbrella. You cool. think a lot. All right. All right. All right. Who's yeah. firing this? I'm firing. Yeah, I don't have Watch your foot on the uh, the tip. Yeah. So you got this way too. You gotta pump it off. Yeah, you gotta pump it. Perfect. Let's get out these days. All right, let's get a little closer. All right. So here we are at about 400 yards. <laughs> you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> what was that? Oh, shoot. Did you guys just see what happened? No, I didn't see that. I see the spear hit the vehicle, though. Did you see that, Mark? That was like the ultimate fail. <laughs> this thing has never failed me. You know what? It might be that rope. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, that. <laughs> see where it hit. All right, we got to try this one more time. I'm not happy. <laughs> I'm not content. I wonder if it was the rope. I wonder. I don't know. Find something long in here. So we kind of gauge the old Dodge out of the side of her. She's right. got her fair share of car parts, I see. The fail might actually work better than that. I just can't believe that didn't work. <laughs> it was the first it time. It didn't work. It, it didn't work. It came out. Uh, 
depends what your goal is. <laughs> My goal is to start small, go goal. through the dodge and hit the road. That's how achievable. That's how far it's yeah. You just want it to come out. <laughs> you just put the bar low, low, eh? Step it up. <laughs> okay. So round two. Here we go. I think I got it this time. I got a good feeling. Yeah. But tonight's gonna be a good night. Whoa. Good damage on the car underneath the door handle there. <laughs> All right. Oh, you're asking that. Look at my aim right through the door handle. Wow. Hey. Clean, real clean. Out of all the things I wanted to hit, I somehow went through the freaking door handle and my rope fell off. <laughs> See, I told you it works good. Yeah. We're gonna do it once more. I'm gonna show you exactly how high this fucker will shoot. The rope will help with that. You should tie this to the rope. The you know flags what? behind it. You just... <laughs> think you're so smart. Oh, <laughs> uh, uh, shoot. Alright. Oh. Well, what do you see? We're gonna do this again. Reload One the gun. One time. Last time. Last time. Since Scott was a fail over there. <laughs> First time using it. <laughs> See what that does to the door? It's crazy, eh? Yeah. Well, time to reload the screw. Reload. No rope this time. We're no just going to shoot it up in the air and see, see how fly, straight it flies. Fly it straight. <laughs> fly it straight. Perfect. Fly it straight. Last attempt. Try and start this damn thing. Come on, Montero Sport. You're a sport. We believe in you. He's getting warm yet? Not bad. <laughs> Good job. Good job. I know I came out for something. I think we need some quick start to put in the suction thing. Yeah. Some ether. All right, we're giving up on that. Breakfast time. <laughs> All right, we're almost at 100. All right, it's Grenade's turn. We're gonna show you how high this usually goes. Fire away. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Today is not our day for the potato gun. I've seen that thing shoot through a tree. And it, you know, it's because Scott's here. I'm the bad luck guy. I'm blaming him. I'm blaming all this on you. That's why I came to uh, Well, I hope you guys got a good laugh at this on freaking YouTube. That was embarrassing. Yeah, like 12 feet. Yeah, that's, that's 12 feet air there. Right. All right, let's get rid of this potato gun. I'm over it. Pretty colors. Wow, all so neat. Wish it'd stay like this, you know, all year. Yeah. Perfect temp. Anyways, I just got this truck this year, February. Had a whole bunch of issues with it. Couple recalls. As you know, I had a 2019 before. Tons of issues. It's a Ford thing. But uh, then it hit a deer, so I just traded it in because the alarm went off a lot after that. I was just really wanted a new truck anyways. But yeah, when I got this truck, a bunch of parts were actually in the back seat. Like they never even installed them. They just threw them in the back seat. <laughs> so uh, I ended up putting them on, but uh, yeah, I noticed a few things. Like half the stuff doesn't even line up. Like this is supposed to be flush, not even close. Um, what else? So it's flush on this side, the hood, but it's not flush on this side. Uh, anyways, and it shoots fire out of the muffler. I mean, sometimes it backfires. So we're gonna try and get it to backfire today. So, hopefully it works, then we'll wrap this video up. <laughs> this friggin' truck. Oh, a tractor. 
Alright, drive away. See? It just shoots flames. All the time. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't do anything I would do or wouldn't do. And uh, get out there and get after it. Don't let your feet on fire. Thank you guys. Subscribe. Go be crazy. We'll see you later.